Yo, and welcome to episode 3 of my Archipelago Assisted Randomizer. So, Subnautica is for today. Um, as with the other two, we'll very quickly show you how to connect to your Archipelago game. Um, basically, the mod will add on the upper left-hand side of the screen over here um, a window for host and your player name and the password if one is set. Um, since I've already done a test or a test on this, you just need to fill these in, tell it to connect, that'll connect you to your game, and then you can start a new game. Um, I do need to delete this test game. Is that the right one? Two days. No, I've already deleted my test game. This is my original game. We need to start a new game. And we'll be playing this in basic survival mode. So we're going to get dumped a whole load of um, unlocks the second we get in, for all intents and purposes. New blueprint acquired. New blueprint acquired. Alrighty then, let's get this fire put out quick like. PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive, to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay, so I'll have to apologize up front to people watching 21 by 9. The way that this game handles its UI um, means that the oxygen gauges and all of that lot are just off. Um, they're like halfway on my left hand screen, so they're not going to be visible to you. Uh, and all of the unlocks are going to appear on my left hand screen as well. And there's not a whole lot I can do about that. So, um, we've been given embedded glass. The radiation suit is available. We need to make fiber mesh, but I don't think we can do that yet. I think, I think we just need to scan and collect a specific thing. We need to make the survival knife sooner rather than later as well. Um, the cutting laser is going to be required for... Um, access to the down ship. Sea Glider should be on this game. I think it should spawn relatively nearby. You're supposed to be able to get this pretty quickly. Ah, so the Seamoth is the um, smaller one. So we have a bunch of other things here. We have torpedoes that have been given to us. I didn't realize we actually researched or found those. But yeah, we've got a bunch of upgrades already. A bunch of depth upgrades for these. Cyclops hull we already have. Um, one piece of. All of this you start with. These are all stuff that I think we got from... I think everything we've got from Hollow Knight. Uh, we're going to need that eventually. Upgrade console is part of the interior of a base and is required to upgrade certain types of vehicles. I don't know if we need it for all vehicles or everything, I can't remember, it's been a while. Anyway, we need to quick like. Start collecting things. The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Alien life forms may have unexpected applications. 
Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Where are my rocks and things? I think I need a scanner for what's ever in here. Okay, we need food fishies and we need rocks. Those are viable food fishies. Maybe be able to get one or close enough to one. Okay, food fishies. I think I need scanner for this, so we need. On. I need a slight speed increase. There we go, we've got some lime scale down there. Let's get some air and then we'll get some lime scale. We have a food fish and a water fish, so it's an A start. Scale. We need one that will give us titanium because I think that's what we get the scanner from. Bombfish. Another creature egg. Not useful at the minute. Oxygen. remember it being that hard to find rocks on the side just to get that tiny bit of tiny or titanium we need or iron or whatever it is all I need is a rock just a rock that isn't lime scale There. Although I think that may be lime scale. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. Yes, finally. Okay. We have the basic stuff we need, I think. Let's see if we can grab another bladder fish. I know we have food and things on board, but having... Some... Or collecting it from fish and leaving those for a while is a better option, in my opinion. Okay. This is water. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. It is common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way for millennia. You can too. Okay, we need the scanner first and foremost, so battery. New blueprint acquired. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. Good. 
the start. We find ourselves more titanium, which we get up pretty quickly. Silicon rubber, I think, is from the plant. That needs the knife. Okay. Right. Uh, no, that was the right button. Punch. How much that's? 20? Okay. Do not neglect collecting of the fish. Specifically, don't forget scanning of the fish. And these can have tech lock behind them. At least they should do. Maybe it's only particular kinds of fish. Oh no, we're being given them. What did we actually get given? Um, so, okay, that's paused. Geo chest green path. That's... Oh no, we did randomise geo chest, we didn't randomise geo box. Progressive personal back tree for Factorio. Soul totem. Palace. That's not what I wanted to see. King Station Stag, though. So we can now get out of King, uh, out of, um, Watchamathingi, although that will just get us stuck in a large room from what we've scanned so far. Okay, where are those big things? I'm sure I saw one around. Unless I've got myself a little bit too... Oxygen. All out. Oh no, we have. You're just a, I think a baby stingray, or baby ray, whatever they're called. Right, we need to find rubbish on the ground. And we have table coral, scannable as well. Those are the things that I was thinking of. They will attack though, so we do need to be mindful of that fact. You're infected. I believe, because you're yellow. Okay, let's see if we can find um, one of the explodey fishy. Um, we have water fish. Aha, uh -huh. you guys. 
oxygen. I don't have a knife in a minute. But we can still pick up those bulbs. My bigger problem is that I can't see those guys. And I'll use a knife to scare them off. Aha! Don't think there's anything in it though. Oxygen. No. Okay. There we go. Junk. noise was that? You're new. I don't think you used to exist. I don't remember you at least. That doesn't necessarily mean anything though. It was however long old this game, however old this game is since the last time I played it. you without blowing you up. We do still need to blow you up at some point. We need the sulphur. But I think we have some basic resources. The sun's come out again so we can see what's lying on the ground a little better. How's our inventory looking? We have space. Shark egg down there. Oxygen. Ooh, scrap. They haven't salvaged yet. And more. Now we're almost out of space. I wonder if scanning the birds counts. It's kind of a tricky thing to pull off though. Oh, we got a charm notch from the cray um from the crayfish. And the Scuttlebug gave us a logistic robot. Or oh, robotics. Logistics robotics. Not sure what that unlocks. Hmm. Kingdoms at. Oh, King. King Station. I don't think King's Station is the one in Kingdom's Edge. I think that's the one... Um, in not Deep Nest, the other one. Okay. Why would we cook the bladderfish? Water from the bladder fish. Cook all the other fish. 
Normal rules. Current logical depth 400. Vehicle zero. Deployables, waterproof locker, useful, not in a minute. Sea gliding, green is unknown, we need to get that as soon as possible. Standard oxygen tank. Give. Ah. Store. Um, store the eggs. Oops, I don't mean to store these, I wanted to eat them. Uh, eat, eat, eat. Drink, drink. New play acquired. High capacity. I didn't need to f search for that. I kind of thought that I would need to. Okay, um, break the materials, get that from the scrap. I thought the high capacity was also one that you needed to scan for. Scrap converted. So what's that need? We need glass and silver ore. Glass is a process resource. It needs quartz. Which I think is the same place that you get um, silver ore. Mm, we don't need another one of those. I probably am going to craft a bunch of these eventually, but we don't need them at the minute. How much titanium do we have? Decent amount. That's not helpful at the minute. Now is copper wire. Um Right. Repair tool, cave sulfur silicon. We need to get sil silicon wool um so ah. We need to get uh, cave sulfur, which means we are going to have to detonate one of those things. Because I can't remember the location of things, so I'm going to need that thing to tell me. So we need to... Collect from those. Detonate a cave silver thingy. There's the nearest one, there's one over there. these for the plant matter but I think we can still grab the bulbs and I think that's where our silicon rubber comes from. Okay, you've got a mouthful of junk. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Did we actually make a thing? We didn't know. Okay. We'll have to hope that one of these is enough to get a silicon rubber for a knife. Uh, could we theoretically still grab cave sulfur? No, we are. Our inventory is entirely full. I 
know whether or not you actually swim faster when not holding anything. I don't think so, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, am I right in this is how we make silicon rubber? Also lubricant, we don't need that yet, we need the rubber. Okay, knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Braxis Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Okay, let's... Um, yeah, let's get a couple of these. these down. Get that. Okay, what else do we need? Air bladder would be useful to have, but we need the repair tool and the light more than anything else. Uh, we could grab another oxygen tank. It will take up a reasonable amount of space in our inventory. I don't think we need it in a minute. Let's go more silicon rubber. We can get the fins so we can swim faster. I have no idea why that appeared over there, but never mind. Okay. Drink that, eat that. Which way is it? I think it is this way, isn't it? Yeah. We'll get a couple of samples of that and then a bunch more bulbs turn into silk and rubber. Oh, we can also now collect table coal. Which has its uses, although I forget offhand what they are. Oxygen. Okay, where was it? I don't remember being this far out. That, however, is worth grabbing. I think. I think it's just salt there. Stay above the sharks. We have our knife so we can defend ourselves from the sharks. We do need to scan a shark. But no, we need to be swimming faster. Priorities. Swim faster and then we'll worry about collecting some more of these um, samples. get sulfur. You 
give up very quickly. There we go. Prawn suit drill arm fragment is what that got us. That's a problem with this particular mod, it seems. This particular mod isn't particularly good at informing the player playing it what they've been given. Keep the salt because I know we can use it for something specific. Okay. Right, fiber mesh, we do need that. Let's get the silicon first. Fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Okay. Good, so that's additional swim speed. We're getting to be able to have the radiation suit, but we do need the radiation helmet. That's a good point. The radiation suit comes in multiple parts. Contains trace of fashion metal. Do we not have access to it yet? Tube coral sand pulls the bleach. Salt with fish. Okay, I think we need to try to beeline finding. Um, we'll grab a small amount of lubricant, but otherwise we'll turn the rest lubricant of this into. Is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. But otherwise we'll turn the rest of this into silicon rubber for now. Okay, we need to find... Uh, actually, no, we need sulfur first. Don't we? I'm going to totally forget which container I put all of this stuff in. Okay, so we need Sawful to be able to make the repair thing. That's the next task. Could also use glass for the flashlight. Okay, where's the nearest cave? You can scan schools now. Okay, let's find path down. These guys only spawn in caves, really. Fragments, we don't need them at the minute. There's 
the way, I wish it was daytime, or I wish I actually had the light first. Never mind. There you are. Come on. Cave sulfur. Aha. What's in here? What's in here as well, but this looks like... Very much a trap. Okay, we've got our quartz, we've got our sulphur, Whoa. the live fish decay do they no okay so we are going to need some titanium out of here I think we need another battery should be enough right advanced Battery equipment, silicon rubber. Okay, uh, there's some in the ship. Glass. Hair tool. Right. Air bladder. I've never actually used one of these, but I get the feeling I'm going to need it. Okay, let's get things equipped. Actually, um, filtered water. Uh, food is okay at the minute. We'll keep them in our inventory uncooked. Right, air tool, flashlight, air bladder. That actually looks like it's the right scale, that's not how things used to be. Secondary systems online. Running full environment diagnostic and outputting results to databank. This is a warrant. Distress signal received. Rescue operation will be dispatched to your location in nine, 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 nine hours. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods. Okay. Sea glider is the next thing. Um, in theory, at least. As long as I can figure out where the parts are supposed to be. We know that they are at least in the safe area. That's where they're supposed to spawn. Mm. 
I'm hoping I don't misidentify random scrap. Uh, I should have grabbed the um, health kit. We don't need any more sulfur at the minute, but still. Scrap metal, it's not part of the sea glider. Let's scan them out so we can scan anything that I don't believe we've found yet. Uh, yes, I remember this resource cave. And the fact that hidden in here is a few things that explode. I'm also not quite remembering how long oxygen lasts for, so I am going to try to play things cautiously even though we're not playing on Hardcore mode. So we don't need to be that cautious. So we come back here for some basic resources. I think we look for the smoother stones. That cave is into a different cave. Nearly I'll expect to find it in things like this. Table salts. I don't think I can get down there without the sea glider. I don't think I have the speed. Huh. There is potentially something. Bin. I do recognize the bin. It doesn't look like we've got a sea glider fragment here. Metal salvage. It doesn't help that I don't wholly remember exactly the thing that I'm looking for. I just have a general idea, but I can't remember what the pieces of it would look like while sitting on the ground. Down there might be good. We have our air bladder, so bugger this up, we can... do I know. You're free to have that, that's not what I need. I don't think what I need is down there. Short range scans suggest this biome supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. Ah uh, yes, you. I remember you. Ok, 
Okay, what else did we get? Um, progressive inserter, mask shard for Hollow Knight. Those are the last two things we found. Okay, there's still potential for stuff down there. The bigger problem is that um, bitey fish. Did I just drop that? Can we not drop the things we want to consume, please? Okay, we need to get up some more water, so we need to find out some more bladder fish and then head back to um, convert them. Now I'm not going to worry about scanning those at the minute. Not what we're looking for, it's just metal salvage. Okay, keep eyes out for bladder fish on the way over. Thirty seconds. Snap sounded nearby, but I don't think it was at us. Can you point it forward, please. Thank you. These give silver. Be advised, a common complication for cave divers is loss of orientation, followed by eventual asphyxiation. I'm aware, I'm not staying down here for any length of time, just have a look. Silver-based wiring kits are an essential component of many habitat modules. There's an egg over there, I believe, just double check. Oxygen. Not a fish. Scannable fish. What do we get? Oh, it does tell us it's just so far off screen it's hard to read. It's much easier to have a look at my um, monitoring screen on the top. Uh, progressive physical projectile damage is what that was. We got ourselves a long way away from our ship. I don't believe these have a use. Number what for? Quartz, more explodey fish. It's more junk. I think we're going to need it to start pointing me towards um down to watch my thingies. Other life pods. How much quartz do we have? 
One, two, three, four, five, six. We actually do need one more for sake of crafting. Okay, let's sort out our immediate needs. Namely, water. And food. Consider disguising the flavor of unsavory meats with salt or locally sourced herbs and spices. Gonna need to go get some more bladderfish. Um, right, I don't think this gives or what we have gives us access to anything. Pathfinder tool. That's useful to have, but it's not required. Habit to build is definitely something we're going to need eventually. As is laser cut and stasis rifle, but we don't have the research for that. We've not found any lead that comes oh we have found lead. We could use a little bit more, but yeah. Fairly sure there's two other parts to the radiation suit. We don't have enough of it. We could, however, get that. Um, Congratulations, survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. What was we looking for or looking at? Yes, that was it. Uh, the oxygen tank is on us. We can grab titanium from beneath us. And we haven't made the progress that we wanted to make. We are still making progress. So we shouldn't complain. Being able to survive longer in the water swim faster is all still forward progress. It will get us places, etc. Um, okay. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 and breath. We don't have the silver for that at the minute, do we? No. Okay. I think we may call it there for an episode. Let's see. Okay, that is the same size. I might start carrying around a second one of these. Um, we have the air bladder to help us get out. Before we finish, though, let's try to make sure we are fully topped up. So, sorry, bladderfish. You are the most convenient source of water. Scene. No, come back, Sky Ray. I was trying to cheese you. Never mind, we'll get an opportunity to scan them at some point. I don't know whether or not we need to or whether it'll unlock anything. Oh, we got a um, stasis rifle. Floaters are apparently a living creature. Stasis rifle fragment from the floaters. Anyway, we shall leave it there for today. Um, we'll be back again on Monday where we'll continue our Factorio playthrough. And then we will continue to go through the motions as we have been doing this week. So we'll have um, Hollow Knight again on Wednesday and then this next Friday. But yeah, thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoyed the show and hopefully we'll see you next time. Cheerio.